You know what I mean? We have an amazing, uh, by the way, RFK Jr. is here. Welcome, sir. <laughs> RFK Jr. He, of course, is going to make America, he's part of the MAGA, make America healthy again, right? I don't know if he's seen what Donald Trump eats, but uh, Donald Trump eats like, well, me and the Cardinal, okay? And um, anyway, now the, now the prompter guy, I, was, I went off book a little bit here. So um, anyway, I'd like to also welcome Mayor Adams, brought to you by Turkish Airlines. Uh, I was told to say that. It's a sponsorship deal, people. Um, you know, we have a lot of formers on the dais tonight, all right? former mayors, former governors, former respected journalists. <laughs> Is there any other kind, really? Now, I understand some people may have an issue with a journalist appearing on a dais, hobnobbing with the rich and powerful. It would appear like a clear conflict of interest, and that's because it absolutely is. <laughs> Look, the days of Walter Cronkite are gone. Most journalists have their own TikTok. You know, uh, the, the president, President Trump, regularly appears on a show called Fox and Friends. That's not a mistake. He's their best friend. <laughs> Former Mayor uh, Bloomberg is here. <laughs> Mayor, Mayor Bloomberg, I want uh, you're going to close that deal on the bring. Uh, us to 10 million? Can you just... <laughs> not an agreement, sir. Okay. Now, by the way, there are rumors that Mayor Bloomberg is planning to buy, I mean, run. <laughs> run for mayor. Uh, I don't know if that's true. Quick question, Mayor Bloomberg. When you buy an election, do you put it on a credit card so you can get the points? Because <laughs> that's what I would do. Um, I already did the RFK joke, so. Uh, but um, anyway, uh, you know, but, well, that, the one thing that I was going to say is that I feel like Donald Trump, uh, you know, make America healthy again. I feel like. Donald Trump would probably be less loyal to RFK than he would be to KFC. <laughs> See what I mean? It's like, I think the rank of Colonel Sanders, uh, some of these I wrote during lunch. Um, Woody Johnson is here tonight, owner of the New York Jets, heir to the Johnson & Johnson pharmaceutical fortune. You know, in divisive times, sir, you are a shining example, okay? If the head of Johnson & Johnson can sign an unvaxxed quarterback, maybe there is hope for this country, all right? Not only is Woody Johnson here, Robert Kraft, owner of the New England Patriots, is here. Welcome. By the way, as we know, they are bitter rivals on the football field. But here tonight, they're here for the same reason. Billionaires supporting Trump. <laughs> it's really beautiful.